what's up? This your boy Keith Bryant, aka GQ Smooth. And the name of this film documentary is called Different, Part Two. Now, part one was uh, me explaining what the definition of being different is. And just like part two is going to be sort of the same thing. Um, but I'm going to rant a little bit when it comes to being different uh, amongst people that are different from other people that aren't different. You know what I mean? Um, so I'm here to explain uh, what the definition of being different is. Uh, being different is you're being different from other people uh, when it comes to how they dress, how they talk, how they see life in a different perspective, doing you, basically. You know what I mean? Not trying to be like everyone else. You're different from everybody else. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to who you are as a person, you know what I mean? And because of you wanting to be different, not wanting to be different, because you are you are different from other people. You're going to be misunderstood, talked about. Uh, you're difficult. You're crazy. You don't understand, you don't know what you're talking about. You're all these names that people are calling you and saying things about you and trying to belittle you uh, because you are different. And when it comes to being different, different equals unique. Different equals being misunderstood. Different equals old soul. Different equals being an empath. Different equals uh, introvert. Different equals uh, being intelligent. All those good things comes with being different. And because you are different, you're going to be talked about. You're going to be called all sorts of crazy names and so forth because you are different. And the people that are calling you different types of names and trying to belittle you and all that is because they want to be you. They want to have your personality. It's something good about you and it's something bad about them. So in conclusion, they want to try and uh, put you down uh, and make you feel less of because they aren't uh, you basically. So they'll call you all sorts of names to put you down to make you feel, you know, uh, just, just sad and just, you know, got your head down like this all the time. No, you know, when people are saying things like that about you is because they want to be you. They, 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 they want something that you have. That's great. That's good or whatever. And, and, and because they can't have what you have, which they can have it if they change their ways, their attitudes and, stuff like that, uh, they can't have it, but because they don't want to have it, they don't want to do what they're supposed to do to have what you have. That's great. That's good. Um, they want to try to put you down and make you feel less of because you are different because you're not following the crowd. Um, you're not doing what they're doing. That's probably negative and evil and deceitful and so forth. And they see something that's good about you. So people will pretend to like you. People will pretend to want to be with you. People will pretend to love you, care for you. People will pretend to uh, pretend to be a good person, but deep down inside, they're not. If someone sees that you're different in a good way, and if someone sees that you're being you uh, or whatever, that, that that's... That, that's that's actually a good thing to me. You know, take me for example. I've always been different. I've been different my whole life. I've had an old soul my whole life. Uh, I've been an empath, introvert my whole life. I've been a good person my whole life. Of course, we all as human beings have, have our flaws and everything. Um, and we all make mistakes, but it's what you do after your mistakes that counts. And it kills me when, when, when you are a different person, than, than you are different than most people. When you're speaking the truth about certain things, when it comes to life, when you see life in a different perspective and everything, and when you're speaking the truth, when you're speaking, when you have integrity and conviction about yourself or whatever, um, such as myself, people will try to uh, twist your truth around when it comes to you speaking the truth about certain things. And people 
know what you're saying is the truth when it comes to anything that you're talking about. Uh, but people will try to twist it around and make it seem like you don't know what you're talking about, you're wrong, and so forth, because uh, they know w within their heart, deep down inside of them, they know that you are the truth, you know what you're talking about, and they don't want to realize that you do know what you're talking about. You know, they always want to be right about everything. You know what I mean? Uh, and I noticed that about people in this day and age, uh, people that I know, people that uh, were uh, associates of mine in the past and future, um, just people in general. I can't stand people like that. But you know what? When you have people that try to belittle you, that try to say that you're difficult, you're this, you're that, and all that, you know, as long as you know that you're not difficult and that you are a great person and that you are a person of God, a person of truth, a person of love, a person of integrity, a person of conviction, a person of intelligence, a person that uh, is uh, just giving, caring, sophisticated. As long as you know within your heart, within your soul, deep down inside of you that you are a good person, fuck what they talking about. I don't give a fuck who it is. You know, somebody got to say some shit like that about you and they know you're a good person, but they know they're a bad person. But they want to put, they want to bring you down to their level. So they want to say little shit about you to try to bring you down, to try to put you down. Fuck those people. You know what I mean? Fuck them. As long as you know the truth about yourself and people saying that shit about you, laugh at them. They're, 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 they're saying that shit because you're different. And ain't nothing wrong with being different. Be you. Be different. Wear, um, wear a, uh, a blue sock and a red sock. It don't have, it don't have to match. If that's what you want to do, you do it. If you want to wear Mitch Match uh, socks or shoes or uh, you want to wear uh, all pink or all uh, blue or whatever color you want to wear that you like, uh, you wear it. And people are going to laugh at you when you go out in public to the store or to work or whatever because you have Mitch Match this and that on. Let the motherfuckers laugh. You're different. And the reason you're different is because you're unique. And you're you. And of course, you're going to be talked about misunderstood, but there's nothing wrong with being different. Everybody can't be the same when it comes to this world that we live in today. And that's the problem with people. They expect for you to be just like them because of this fucked up, twisted ass, corrupted generation, brainwashed generation that we live in today, just because you can't be like them and they want you to be like them. They want you to be like this generation that we live in today. And because you're not... You get laughed at, you get talked about, you get you you they're gossiping behind your back, whether you're in a friendship, relationship, marriage, family, people are gonna talk about you. I don't give a fuck what kind of situation or uh 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 uh, uh friendship, relationship, marriage, or family membership that you're in. People are gonna talk about you because you are different. You know what I mean? And they don't wanna be different, they wanna be fake, they don't wanna change. And they want to try to put you down because you're different. There's nothing wrong with being different. That's just that's like saying, you know, uh, everybody has to be a criminal. You know what I'm saying? Like, if it wasn't, if the word different didn't exist and everybody going around killing people, you know what I'm saying? It's like, you have to be different. You have to be different. You can't be the same. You can't be like these people robbing people out here. Like, no, you. there's a such thing as being different. You have to be different. You can't be like everyone else. Just like there's white, there's black, there's Asian, there's Chinese, there's African, there's different nationalities. We're different. I mean, we're all human beings, but we're different colors. But but when it comes to uh, uh, being human beings, we're all human beings. We're just different colors. We all have the same blood and that's red. You know what I mean? So, you know, we're different. So it's nothing wrong with being different, but, you know, uh, simple-minded people out here expect for you to be just like them because of this, this, this punk-ass generation that we live in is so fucked up in this generation. People want you to be just like them. And because you are different, because they're not used to you, the person, as far as being different, they're used to certain type of people. So when, 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 when it comes to friends, family, 
relationship, marriage, they now they have somebody different that's within their presence. They really don't know how to abide by it. They really don't know how to, to go by it. So, you know, and you can always tell when, um, when you're in the presence of someone, you can tell when the laughter is real. You can tell when the love is real. You can tell when the vibe is real. You can tell when the energy is real. You can tell, you can feel with, with inside your soul, within your presence that that person or those people are really real when it comes to their being genuine or whatever, you can tell. Uh, so when you are a different person, when you're different from what they're used to, or from what those people are used to, and you feel like the energy is, it, it's, it's, it's not really, the energy's there, but it's, it's there to a certain extent, but you can feel when somebody's really being real with you and genuinely real with you. You can just feel it. You can feel the energy. You can just feel it. Uh, but you get all of that when it comes to being different. When it comes to being different, you're going to be misunderstood when it comes to this world we live in today. Um, I've been misunderstood many times, but I don't let that get me down. I keep striving. I keep going forward. And when someone's trying to put me down, when someone's calling me all sorts of names and all that, I don't care who it is, I laugh at it. Because if someone has to do that to you because you are different from what they're used to, then that person is the poorest person in the world. I don't give a fuck how much money that person got. I don't give a fuck how much uh, materialism, uh, materialistic stuff they have within their presence. I don't care if they got a nice, fancy car, a nice, beautiful house, uh, fancy jewelry, clothes, uh, whatever. That don't mean nothing. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, that doesn't mean anything. Uh, if a person has to do that or think that they, they are better than you or whatever, um, then that is the poorest person in the world. I don't give a fuck how rich you are, how much money you got. You're still a poor person when it comes to your personality and your character. If you got to put somebody down because they're different, because they talk different, they talk with conviction, integrity, all that good shit, and you put them down because you're none of those things, because you don't want to be none of those things. So since you can't be none of those things, you want to put that person down shit. You are the poorest person in the fucking world. Straight up. Straight up, man. And I laugh at people like that. But for the people, you know, out there, you know, um, it's all right to be different. Keep on being different. No matter what these jokers say out here on the streets, in your family, in your relationship, in your marriage, uh, 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 associates, whatever, they're just doing that because they're fucked up inside. Their life is fucked up. Their character is fucked up. Their integrity is fucked up. Uh, they're they're messed up individuals. So they want you to be messed up like them. So they'll try to put you down to make you feel so sad about yourself. But you know what? Don't be sad about yourself. When someone says something like that about you, that you're this, you're that, laugh at them. Laugh at them. And when you laugh at them and you kill them with kindness, that'll make them even madder and confused. Like, damn, you know, this person ain't going off. No, ain't no reason to go off because as long as you know the truth about yourself, as long as you know that whatever that person says about you isn't the truth, don't sweat that shit. Keep on moving forward, going about your business, enjoy your day, go have a, a, a pizza, uh, go have some salmon, whatever, nice breakfast, lunch, dinner, go take a walk, whatever, in the park, you know what I'm saying, have you a nice little glass of wine, uh, listen to some music, watch a good movie, pray to God, the only God, you know what I'm saying, the great God that is, and keep moving forward and laugh at those jokers, you know what I'm saying, because I laugh at people like that all the time. I've had that done to me from back then to now, to the future or whatever, and I laugh. I don't let people like that get to me because I'm going to have more success. I'm going to have more blessings than that person. You know what I'm saying? Because that, 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 those people are, that person is a poor person when it comes to their, their mindset, their personality, and their character. So it's all right to be different. Keep on being different. Keep on being you. For all the people that want to be different out there, keep on being different. Don't let no motherfuckers out here, no jokers, nobody tell you otherwise because they just mad because they don't want to be different. You know what I mean? They don't want to change. They want to keep being the fucked up individuals they are. You know what I mean? So keep on being different.
keep on being different, keep on being different, keep on being different. Ain't no shame in that. You know what I mean? Keep on being you. You know what I'm saying? So walk with integrity, walk with conviction, you know what I'm saying? Be different. You know what I'm saying? So I just had to do this um, documentary called Different Part 2 because I had to do it. I wanted to do it. And I'm doing it now. So this is your boy, Keith Bryant, a.k.a. GQ Smooth. I'm here to say peace, love, and harmony. God is love. Love is God. Keep on being different. You want to be different? Keep on being different. Don't let nobody steer you wrong. All right? Peace. Man, man.